Hi, I will uh, give you a short tutorial if you have purchased a new RAM and want to add to your current uh, PC and for example your RAM is made of different brand okay there's actually a short some steps that you need to follow first turn off your PC okay once it's off turn it on again and then we will need to enter the BIOS screen okay we will need to uh, the best is to clear the BIOS so what you can do is the moment it's turned on uh, you can spam your delete or F2 F2 okay go inside your BIOS screen usually we will go to the because uh, every BIOS is different so usually what we will do is we will go to the advanced mode okay once in advanced mode we will need to go to settings okay uh, for some motherboard it's right at the right side okay the far right you need to go to the save and exit place okay on the screen save and exit go there and then look for restore default restore default or optimize default because we want it to run at the factory default first before we add different RAM onto your system so re restore the default load optimize yes and then save changes and reboot okay after that your PC will shut down and reboot that is very normal wait for a bit and then we will need to enter again into BIOS to confirm that it's already reset into a default before we turn off the PC to install the new RAM. Okay, so right now we are entering the BIOS. Just need to double check. Okay, everything is in factory default. So what you can do, shut down your PC, everything is shut down. Take your new RAM, okay, slot it into your motherboard. So for more information on the configuration, you can check with us as well. Okay, for example, I'm using a two different RAM. I'll need to set it in default first, just in case we have conflict. Okay, we'll start the PC again. Uh, go, go back into the same procedure. Okay, spam your delete and F2 key to enter the BIOS. Right after that, we will need to set the XMP profile if it's available. So if you have two RAM that comes in different frequency, for example, 2666 and 3002, you will need to follow the slower one, which is the 2666. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'll go into my advanced mode. Settings, uh, usually some is on the OC, OC page, some is called OC tweaker, things like that. And then you can go to your XMP profile, activate your profile one. Okay, so these two RAM, has different frequency mm -hmm. so one is 2666 and the other one is 3006 I will need to follow a 2666 for stability so once I activated my profile one I can click F10 okay on the keyboard F10 which means save and then enter save and exit mm -hmm. so your PC will shut down again and reboot into the configured frequency so that's about it on how to add different types of brand uh, RAM into the same motherboard